Hey guys, Brian Shulman Brown here, physical therapist, CrossFit coach, and wellness coach with Get Your Fix Physical Therapy. Wanted to get on here after kind of fielding some questions the past several weeks, actually. Hey, Scott. On why... <laughs> hey there. On why we get pain during exercise, but maybe not until... 10, 15 minutes into it. Um, I've had one recently that's not until he runs about 15 miles um, for someone who runs more of the ultra marathon type distances. Um, on why the pain doesn't occur until later. So there's a couple different reasons. Um, typically the primary reason that I find is because of muscle endurance fatigues out. So basically, when you star and when you go for a certain amount of time, those muscles support the joints and protect the joints just fine without any issues. Hey Kelly, hey Eric. But once you get going for a while, those muscles start to fatigue. They just don't have that endurance that's needed in order to continue protecting those joints and maintaining the stability in your joints. And so we get pain. So, when we're running, um, so if you're running, what can happen is the muscles in the lower leg typically or the hip tend to get tired. So over time it causes the legs to kind of internally rotate, the knees to turn in a little bit, and that causes a lot of problem, um, increased pressure on those joints in ways they aren't supposed to move, and so we start getting pain. A lot of times what happens that I see in my CrossFitters or Olympic lifters is in the shoulders. So with pull-ups, with overhead pressing type motions, the shoulders lose the stability because they just get tired. And so then the rotator cuff has to take over, the biceps takes over, and we start getting a lot of irritation in the tendons around and the muscles around the shoulder. So... Uh, basically we need to work what happens happen is need to work on the stability in those muscles and getting that endurance in those muscles up rather than the necessarily the strength in them the other thing that can happen is the joints just aren't moving properly um, your biomechanics are off in some way because something's not moving right so going back to running if the hip is tight or the ankles are tight, typically the knee takes the brunt of it because the knee then starts moving in a way that it's not supposed to. And then it's over, shoot, there we go, okay. Ah, sorry, hand buzz on my phone. Over time, the joints just get tired of moving incorrectly and so they cause, they start getting painful so your body, to it basically tells your body to fix me. Same thing can happen, um, go back and going back to the shoulder. If a lot of times with my overhead athletes, I find that the upper back, the thoracic spine is not moving right. So the same thing can happen um, if that, you don't get that extension through there when you're going to reach up overhead, the shoulder has to move a little bit more than it's supposed to. So over time that shoulder um, joint gets irritated. So. Those are typically the two reasons why we get pain over a period of time, not in the beginning of our workout or our run. Um, either thing, the muscles just don't have that endurance to protect and hold the joint stable, or we're getting increased motion somewhere because something else isn't moving right. So I know that's it can be confusing, it's a lot of information. If you have any questions, definitely post them on here. I would love to answer those questions for you or feel free to message me directly if you have anything specifically concerning um, or an issue concern that you have that you want answered and I would an will be happy to answer that for you. Um, and just one more reminder, since I won't, probably won't get a chance to get on here tomorrow, if you are local in the Phoenix area, I am doing my runner seminar on Saturday at two o'clock, so at my office. So if you want to register for that, go to my website, getyourfixpt.com and register for that. I'd be happy to have you here. So 
Uh, once again, if you have any questions, definitely post them on here. Otherwise, I will talk to you guys later. Have a good one. Bye.